popularity of the new Apple X's facial recognition, and Samsung has a plan for a different smartphone. Jane King is at the Nasdaq Market Site with these stories and more. It's your King Tech Report. The new iPhone 10 can be unlocked with your face, but is that secure? Well, Apple says the processing is done entirely on the device and not in the cloud. In an effort to protect a user's privacy, the process is also designed, according to Apple, to prevent someone from using a mask or photo to fool the device. Well, wireless carriers are boosting their trade-in and other offers as the new iPhones get ready to hit the market. AT&T is offering a free iPhone 8 and 8 Plus with the purchase of another. T-Mobile will give customers $300 off any new iPhone with a trade-in, and Verizon also has a trade-in deal with up to $300 offered, depending on the model. I'll be sure to read the fine print on those deals, though. Amazon preparing to open a 1 million square foot warehouse near Mexico City. Mexico's e-commerce industry is still in its early stages, so Amazon wants to get a head start in the country. The facility would triple Amazon's distribution space in Mexico, home to around 120 million potential customers. And Samsung plans to release a smartphone that folds next year. It's already incorporated elements of the technology and its curved Galaxy Edge phones. Now well, that's interesting, but why do this? Well, it does mainly reduce the size of the phone to fit into smaller spaces. It could also double as a small tablet, but not all apps are made to work with bendable and folding phones. From the NASDAQ market site in Times Square, I'm Jane King with your Tech Report. Jane.